Hey everyone, it's Marco here, back once again from the My Color Screen channel and welcome to the world of Android customization. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you two apps, one that's free-ish and one that's paid, that are both sort of game changers when it comes to customizing your Android phone. So without any further ado, let's bring you today's new video. Alrighty, so first up, the first app I'll be showing you is the one called Super Widget Gallery by the artist Giant Turtle. And of course, pretty much the name says it all, it is a Zupo Widget Gallery, which I've been waiting for for ages. If I'm just opening it right now, and let's just see, this is basically what it is. If you've ever struggled to look for a good Zupo Widget, browsing either through XDA or just on the Play Store, and it takes quite a while and it's not that easy and finally this developer has decided well hey why not this is put all of them all in one place even though it might not include the ones from the the play store which is not such a bad thing because some of these are truly brilliant and of course you can sort them by popularity alphabetical or date created which is also pretty awesome now it comes in two variants you can just download the free version and all it'll do is say if i wanted this one right here i would select it and you select the download button if you have the free version, it'll take you to the XDA link, but pretty much these are all user created from the XDA site. So pretty much if you've got the free version, it'll take you to the XDA link where you can just download the zip from there and then just pretty much copy it onto your, download it onto your phone. However, if you like me and you went for the pro version, then it pretty much does all of that for you. All you have to do is click OK. It'll download this very theme and then it'll simply appear in your Zupa widget gallery. So what do I mean by that? If I hold down on my home screen now, I'll just go into widgets, want to add in a widget. So I'm just going to add in a Zupa widget, doesn't really matter what size, as you know. I'm just going to hold down on it, select resize, so just get it into a bit of a, a better shape. Just going to select the skin right now. Now just take note, it's not going to appear in your main templates on the main page, and that's pretty much because these are from the Play Store, and this app does it a bit differently. If you go now into your SD card, it's, this is where it basically saves all of them and that's pretty cool as well. It's not too big of a deal So here it is that one that I just downloaded the play apps description or whatever And I'm just gonna go back see what it looks like and there it is added quick and simple like that I didn't have to go into the XDA Forums and spend hours looking for it. It just popped up just like that and how quick and simple was that and just because it's downloaded And it's in the SD card and it's basically free you can now do whatever editing that you'd want You can still go into the layouts and do all this editing for you. You can change whatever you want. You can change any of the hotspots. So I definitely recommend that you go try it out, especially the pro version. This has so much potential. I'm fine. I'm so glad that someone's eventually gone and done this. So yeah, you definitely want to go and try out this Zupa Widget Gallery. Great. So for the second app of this video, it is this one here titled, I'm not too sure how to say it. I think it's Iconas or Iconas, but it's by Specify and wow, it is a game changer of note. You might be a little bit confused what this app actually does and a lot of people have been confused, but I'm just going to break it down for you. If you open the app like this, it might give you a little bit of information here what it actually does. You've got some icon packs right there and then Zupa widget and UCCW right over there. So what exactly does this icon, well this iconas actually do? Well let us see, I've just added my Zupa widget here on the side. But I want to add some icons to it, especially ones from the paid icon packs. Now how exactly would I do that? Well I couldn't do this before because simply those icon packs were pretty much rigid and you can only add them if you say had a launcher that could support icon pack templates. Well this is where Iconas or Iconas comes in. If I select I'll add a new module right now and obviously for UCCW it'll be in a similar fashion and I go to bitmap now. Now of course I'm just going to scroll down a bit more and go to bitmap. And like remember I said beforehand you couldn't do this at all as only a very few icon templates were supported such as this eternal pack here by a random package. However, now we have Iconas right here that if I push this little menu button right here it brings up the current icon packs that I currently have installed and say I want to choose Synergy right here, the one by Toxic Thunder that I truly enjoy. Now it's got all of these icons here. Now remember, this isn't really piracy as I've really had to download or pay and install Synergy on my phone in order for these to appear. So just take note of that. And yeah, so we don't think it's too pirated or piracy related. So all the guys have checked it out. So it should be pretty much good to go. Now say if I wanted to add in, say, a contact app, let's look for one. Or let's look for this people one right here. And bam, it's now been added onto my Zupa widget. How cool is that? Now I can just put this or place this next to my contacts icon. And then I have a neat little icon baked right into my Zupa widget. So if I just exit it right now, let's just see what it looks like. 
how cool is that? I have now have my own custom icon pack that I personally paid for in a Zupa widget. Very, very cool. And like I said, it is quite a game changer. So that's pretty much the two apps that I think you should definitely go and try out. Let, let me know what you think in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up as well as to please subscribe to the My Color Screen channel if you haven't already. Also, don't forget to check out our various social communities. We are on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, pretty much you name it, we are on it. And last but not least, don't forget to check out My Color Screen's official one-click theming launcher that you see before you here. It is titled Thema Beta. It's still in beta, but you can download it free from the Google Play Store and don't forget to leave a review. As you can see, you've got a list of a whole bunch of fantastic looking home screens right here that you just need to select. You just need to click apply and then it'll install within seconds an awesome looking Android home screen. So thank you very much guys for watching. Marco here from My Color Screen. And as always, don't stop customizing.